As residents of Humboldt County, we live in a tsunami danger zone. Due to frequent earthquakes in our area and at sea, all citizens of the North Coast should pay close attention to the ocean at all times. Though the waves may seem calm and the shore serene, do not be fooled. A quiet day at the beach could very well become a soaking wet, life-threatening experience. As for any natural hazard, a quick set of guidelines and warnings could save your life if a disaster should occur. Before visiting the beach, be sure to check for high surf advisories by the National Weather Service. If large waves are expected, it may be a good plan to postpone the trip for a couple days. If you do decide to risk the visit, basic beach safety could be the difference between life and an untimely death. Beware of sneaker waves. These bandit-like waves could appear at any time, and if caught unawares, you might find yourself sideswiped and drowning. While it may serve recreational and aesthetic purposes, the Great Pacific is a mighty force of nature that will kill you at a second's notice. Beware. If you should ever find yourself encountering a tsunami, do not stand and fight. Flight is your only option. Quickly ascend the nearest hill or tall object and hope you survive the downpour. If at all possible, get behind a tsunami danger zone sign. These markers assure your safety after you have passed their invisible boundaries. <laughs> Cars were picked up. It destroyed the uh, ecosystem. Yeah, you can see all the leaves blown onto the ground. Yeah. I climbed a tree. It was this one. And uh, describe... Describe how the water, how high the water was. I don't know, I was focusing on the tree. Really? Yeah. The first thing I knew, I saw this big water ball just coming and I, I was already next to this tree and so I just, just hopped on it and I just started, I started climbing. I just, just, just. Yeah, it was, saved your life. it was pretty intense. I owe it all to her. Is that all you need? I was surfing, bro. Really? That yeah. seems like... So you're out in the water? Yeah, I was in the water. Uh, it was a small day. I was catching some good ones. And, uh, you know, there was probably like 15 other dudes out there. And all of a sudden, I turned around like, there's a big old wave coming, bro. And I was like, what are you talking about, man? So I turn around and I see this freaking fatty, like, 40-footer. And I'm thinking, that must be a tsunami or something. And I'm like, dude, screw that. I'm gonna go catch that wave. So I turn around, and I start paddling it out, right? And all of a sudden it starts breaking and I'm like, <laughs> I'm gonna get on this thing. So I freaking, I just, I just paddle in and then whoop -pat! And then, and I just pull in and all of a sudden it just it starts, it starts breaking and I just pull in and whoop -pat! And I just, I just got pitted, man. So pitted, and I just kept riding this wave, and it's the biggest wave I've ever seen. And I just keep riding it, right? All of a sudden, I'm, like, I'm freaking like in Arcata, and I'm like, shit, dude, I'm in Arcata. And all of a sudden, like, I keep riding it, and then I'm like, I look over, and I like, I'm by this tree, and there's this dude in the tree, and I was like, that's pretty clever. That guy's in the tree, so he won't get hit by the wave, man. So then all of a sudden, I'm looking around, and there's nobody on the wave, bro. And I'm like, dude, I'm the only one on this wave. So I was like. I'm the only one on, it's got to be the biggest wave I've ever caught, right? And so I'm, I'm like, I'm like in Arcata, and, and that's, that's, that's my experience. So uh, where were you at the time? I was, I was just riding my scooter, man, and like going down, the, going down the road, and I look up and there's this huge wave. I'm like, whoa, what's a wave from an Arcata, right? Like, that's not where waves are supposed to be. They're supposed to be in the ocean. This isn't the ocean, this is Arcata. And there's this dude riding the wave. And he, I look at him, I'm like, wait, is it? Is that E. Jackson? It's E. Jackson in the wave. And like, I'm just on my scooter, I'm like, just kicking, right? I'm like, oh, look at him go. And the wave broke and sprayed and, yeah. I didn't see shit. <laughs> Remember, next time you find yourself walking the beach, humming a tune and smiling, stop. You walk in overwhelming danger. The next wave hurtling towards you could very well spell your death if you remain unprepared. However, with a little caution and a drop of preparation, you may escape the beach completely dry.